In this video we share Our Lady's message to Valeria Copani for December 28, 2022. Please, like, share, comment and subscribe to assist me in sharing these messages to a broader audience. Here is Our Lady's message to Valeria. My daughter, pray for all your unbelieving brothers as there is very little time left for their conversion. I always pray for all my children, but like every mom I pray for my most needy children. You can't imagine how many young people no longer walk through the church door. They waste their time behind so much nonsense, even at night they go out into the streets of the world to blaspheme the name of my son. They do not remotely think that soon they will have to account for all their shortcomings towards Jesus and me, most holy mother of Jesus. I recommend to you believing children, approach these young people, tell them about the goodness of Jesus for them and how much suffering they are giving us. They do not understand that all the evil they are doing with their disobedience to God, will pour abundantly over them, so much so that they lose their lives for eternity. I am always close to them, but they are so tempted by Satan that they no longer listen to our voices. My children, you who live under our protection, pray, pray, pray for your times are truly about to be fulfilled. These poor young people do not realize how great their suffering in the underworld will be. Pray, pray, pray that all my children far from God, return to the priests to enjoy, in the confession of their sins, the forgiveness of God. I love you so much and I want you all with me. Most Holy Mother Mary. Valeria Copani's story of receiving locutions from heaven started when she was in Lourdes accompanying her military husband on pilgrimage. There she heard a voice that she identified as her guardian angel, telling her to get up. He then presented her to Our Lady, who said, You will be my Senecal, a term she only understood years later when a priest used it in the context of the prayer group she started in home city of Rome, Italy. It was Father Gabriele Amorth who encouraged Valeria to diffuse her messages outside the prayer Senecal. The attitude of the clergy is predictably mixed, some priests are skeptical, while others participate fully in the Senecal. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.